Satnam, so lusciousness. I decided to sit in my own luscious backyard to talk to you about lusciousness and really appreciating what lusciousness can bring to you, right? Oh my God. And understanding that sometimes when our lusciousness gets turned in, it becomes all about me. I need you to listen to me. You know, I need you to give me everything. I need you to do everything for me. We all like to be in a relationship with somebody who's liberated, right? So it could be all about us. But true lusciousness is something that's priceless. And I want to give you a prayer that's really powerful that when you feel stuck on you, you can do for other people. Satnam, I want to give you something to interrupt you, okay? When you are in the fire flow, and I mean the lava is coming down on you, you are angry, you are upset, you are jealous, you are just this. Okay, I want to give you something that can really work to interrupt that so that you can get back to the fire that you need to help you grow and create, not destroy. Because, let's face it, fire has a destructive aspect to it. And I want you to understand how you can avert that volcanic flow. All right? So as soon as you feel that coming upon you, and we all know what that feeling feels like, mm -hmm. we turn into Corella Deville. We turn into, you know, what we think of as Kali. Only truly Kali sucks the death out of you. She doesn't inflict it. She kills you so that you can live forever. So this is a really simple one. Four-part breath is fabulous, and four-part breath is just... Four parts inhale, four part exhale. You can do it through your nose, through your mouth, and just. It's a great interrupter. A better interrupter is dragon breath, which employs four part breath on the inhale, and on the exhale, you're going to. Close your eyes if you're not driving, okay, on the inhale, and just do. But on the exhale, this is where it counts, and it's so fun and so fabulous and so weird. And if you teach this to everybody, then you're going to know that when you're freaking out, somebody, all that somebody has to do is they walk by you and they'll do this, and you'll know, okay, get it together. And you, we can do this to each other, right? We can serve each other in this flow to get back into the flow of our fire not be consumed by the fire. So it's and then you get to open your eyes super wide, stick your tongue out and go okay, nobody looks good doing this, so get over that, all right? I've had people go, I can't stick my tongue out. My mother told me never to stick my tongue out. Good, get over it, all right, ready? We're gonna do this together three times. I promise if you do this in the middle of a fight, all of a sudden the fight ends. Because it's like, what the hell did you just do? If you teach this to your children, when they get upset, they have something to do besides a time out. It's a time to understand you can transform this energy. You know, we have a choice. Transmute, transform, transgress, you know, or just let it play out and get the